guys, how you going? Hope you're all doing very well. This afternoon I'm going to be doing another movie review. This movie is a horror film from Spain, Spanish language English subs, released in the year 2022, directed by Carlotta Pereira, and this film is called Piggy. So Piggy is about an overweight teenager. She's constantly picked on by the beautiful girls in the town. She wants to be like them, but she just can't connect with them because they're always putting her down. So one afternoon, they're at a swimming hole, and the bullying goes uh, another step above, and she starts you know, becoming very hysterical. She's crying, she's been assaulted, they've taken her stuff, but on her walk home, her life is going to be changed forever because something ghastly happens that really puts her in the firing line of not only the paranoia of the town, but also an invisible threat that is getting closer and closer to her. So what that threat is is something you're going to have to find out for yourself because that's as far as I'm going with my synopsis. Now my thoughts on Piggy. This is a movie about bullying. Now it's not the first film about bullying, but I definitely feel as though it's a very important subject matter to actually get out there, to, uh, to shine a light on what people actually have to go through, whether it's for being overweight, whether it's for you know being gay, or whatever. You know, there is a lot of people out there that will pick on something that is different to them. And so it's not the first film, there are a lot of movies that depict this, but I can never really criticise a film for recycling such a very, very strong uh, message and how important it is to actually get it out there. So as far as a horror film is concerned, it is a very good concept for a horror film. And so coming into Piggy, I was initially feeling as though this movie would go down a certain direction, but it goes down another direction. And I can applaud the fact that it wanted to be creative. And so it is trying something a little bit different that does demonstrate a lot of guts, uh, but unfortunately the movie does doesn't really work as well as I think the director wanted it to and that's something I'll go into a little bit later but what I liked about the movie was the atmosphere it's a very European atmosphere if you've ever seen French noir films this movie actually reminded me of a French noir in that you know something in the atmosphere was starting to magnify in a way that you couldn't really put your finger on it but there was a very strange uneasy quality to this movie and that was down to the cinematography and that was down to the characters everything about this movie had a set level of ugliness to it you've got the bullying you've got the ugly attitudes from these people on the outside of this main character and it was like she was in a world of her own and when she meets this threat I thought they were seeking solitude within with, uh, each other and I thought that was strangely beautiful but it was very very morbid and so I have to be careful not to get anything away here but there is a lot to like about this film at the same time as there is a lot to dislike about the film so it is fairly nasty at the end there's a little bit of gore in there but it doesn't rely on the gore it just relies on that really strong sense of discomfort whether it's through the bullying or whether it's through how this movie progresses to the climax that it does and so the film does have that horrific sort of feel to it it has that nasty feel to it but at the same time as I said it's that strange absorbing quality that intensifies that nastiness and so it's a very competent production and I thought the acting especially from the main character was actually quite competent as well so, so as far as bully films are concerned you'd kind of think you know where this movie is going but the director will take you down a different path I kind of like the direction that the the director takes but there were elements that I didn't really like and the biggest problem with the piggy was the exaggerated quality that the film has. You have these bullies that are exaggerating their nastiness. Now yes there are people out there who are completely nasty but I just felt as though this movie was trying too hard to give you that sense of sympathetic quality to the main character and if a movie tries too hard you start to disconnect yourself from it because it starts to feel cartoonish. And so the movie wants to be serious but at the same time it does have that cartoonish element that makes you feel as though you're disconnecting yourself and as the movie progressed I was becoming more and more disconnected from the current situation. So as the film goes on, I thought the middle stages of this film were very stagnant, it got stuck and it didn't know really how to kick into gear. It does kick into gear a little bit later but there's a noticeable area in the middle of this film that I thought really dragged and it didn't really go anywhere. And the reason why it didn't go anywhere is because there was a lot of character interaction. Because I didn't really believe these characters, the interaction just doesn't work. And so the whole film had a really noticeable disjointed sort of element in the middle of the movie and then it gets back into the horror element, but I just felt as though the human interaction and the human sort of emotion in this movie wasn't as strong as it could have been because they, need to lay, they needed to lay back a little bit on the exaggeration of the nastiness. And so that to me was the biggest issue to Piggy. And I thought as though it, it got a little bit side attracting what it wanted to be. So if it was a little bit more simplistic, I thought it would have been a lot better. If it just laid back a little bit in the exaggeration of how all of the nastiness was thrust upon this character to give you the sense of sympathy that she was going through, I just thought as though it would have been a lot better. So it's not a very realistic film. And I thought as the message that it wanted to depict, it needed to be a little bit more serious than it was. And so the whole film just has that moment of, okay, on one hand it is a worthy experience, but on the other hand, I just felt as though it was taking a little bit more 
more seriously, if it was a little bit shorter and had a lot more clarity in the direction it wanted to go in, it could have been absolutely fantastic. But there are very likable moments in it, but unfortunately, overall, I just felt as though it was trying a little bit too hard to tug on the heartstrings. So overall, for Piggy, it is recommended if you like your revenge sort of bully movies, but unfortunately, it could have been a lot better than it was. I'm going to give this film two and a half stars. Alright guys, this is it for my review. Hope you enjoyed it. Till next time, keep watching movies and I'll see you later.